world, I'm Rich, and this is Rich's World Beer Tour. This is take two. I couldn't get the cork out the first time, so hey, we got a live studio audience. My folks, my sister, my wife. If there's general laughter, you know what's going on. Long of Tooth. It's Minnesota Monday. Long of Tooth. Surly Brewing and De Proof Browery, Locristi, Belgium. Um, on March 31st, 2014, the collaborative minds of Surly's head brewer Todd Haig and DeProof's brewmaster Dirk Knotts brewed this one-of-a-kind ale inspired by English old ales and Belgian chocolate. So uh, they sat down for quite a while and hammered out their vision. There it is. It's an old ale aged on toasted oak and cacao. Sounds tasty. Now the reason why this is part two is I could not get the cork out. So. Uh, Hey guys, you, I'm hoping you're making good beer, but you uh, sealed it in there very well. Let's get this thing open. We haven't had a, uh, a little one-off uh, from Surly in quite a while. Well, that worked fine. A little smoke, give me the glass. There we go. Take that. That is a beautiful brown, a little ruby around the edge, about a fingers and a half worth of head. I don't have a lot of sunlight today, but yeah, ruby, dark brown, kind of a root beer colored beer. Let's get a nose on her. I We're up brewing today, by the way. a lot of red in there. I should, I should have given, we got our uh, stout going here. It's going to be um, a coffee stout. Uh, we've put our uh, red ale to secondary fermentation and we're brewing again. So big deal here, big day here. Oh my, check that out. I'm getting some, uh, actually I'm getting some of the stuff from over there. That's Belgian, no doubt about it. Very I'm, much so. I'm not gonna say funky, barnyardy, <laughs> yeasty. It is yeasty. That's, that's your normal comment it is, when it comes it is to yeasty. the Belgians. Belgian yeasty, there's hay. You smell that? That, that hay, that, that hay loft. I think as, as uh, your sister, my wife, described today, it smells like the state fair. It smells like the state fair. <laughs> yeah, that's, it's sweet. There's cherries in there. There's uh, hay. Yeah, it's, it's just that very typical Belgian yeast I smell. I like it. Yep. Give it a taste. Cheers. That head is just a pig. Wow, that is smooth. One thing I did not do. I don't get the chocolates in it, though, that they're talking about. I, I get a definite sweetness. 10% ABV. But I don't get the chocolate so much. The Belgian chocolate, that's... It was inspired by Belgian I chocolate. I understand, but it, there isn't a lot of chocolate in it. There's definitely a sweetness and a smooth, smoothness to it, but no real chocolate. Oh, this is this is smooth and caramely. This is like a uh, fine English barley wine. Do you get that? That uh, just absolute caramel malt forward. The there's cher there is cherries in there oh, yeah. at the end. Yeah. That that slight bitterness. Uh, and the Belgian yeast. And the Belgian yeast. I don't get the the cacao nibs at all. I, I maybe as she warms. This is probably about 50 degrees. We've had it out of the fridge for half an hour at least. Everybody's being so quiet off camera. We're gonna, we'll get uh, a, a few more opinions. I'll put them down below on the, uh, on the channel. This one's driving good. It is. Yeah, it's it's a great barley wine. I love the I love the flavors mixing in that in that the maltiness, that that sweet, and then the tart at the end. I, I get the cherries, um, and I don't know what we we're supposed to taste, but that doesn't matter. It's what we are tasting. Give me a give me a rating on this. Uh, nine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go eight on it. I I, I like it. It's not uh, blowing my socks off, but I really like it. It might get better as as she ages. Um, if you've tried it at home, uh, put some notes down below. Uh, this is probably Twin Cities and Chicago only right now, um, and I'm not sure how many batch, how many uh, barrels they made. But Long and Tooth, Surly Brewing, and the uh, DeProof 
Browery, the Browery de Proof, La Christi, Belgium. Um, nice, eight or nine out of ten, uh, a good beer. Thanks for sharing a beer with us, world. Cheers, world. Cheers.